Hey guys, it's Melvin7 here, and today I'm bringing you another sport builder on a Wednesday. Now, I don't know what I'm going to call this series, because I will literally be doing this every single Wednesday. I might also do one on Saturday or Sunday. It's basically where I pick a squad builder from the previous squad builders comment section if that makes any sense uh, as you'll see on screen now just leave a comment below and I'll pick one at random and yeah thanks to Dylan Deary for this suggestion literally all he said was a 20k starter team now you can make it as specific as you want or you can put some players in that you want me to hybridize or whatever or it can be a one league team I'm not really bothered but yeah 20k last week we had a million so this time we have went really really cheap at 20k so, in there we've got All Black, about, well, 700 coins, which is the minimum you can pay for him, I believe. Yeah, it is, literally. So, yeah, 6 foot 1, you're not going to get much better for 700 coins. And, uh, yeah, the first centre-back we've got, we've got Rami, 1,000 coins. You can probably get him for minimum now. I built this, uh, well, a couple of days after the comment. And, yeah, 81 defence, 81 physical, 6 foot 3 as well. 68 pace isn't bad. Pace isn't really that much of a factor compared to other FIFAs in this FIFA. And, yeah, we've got someone who's very, very similar. Jimenez, non-rare, 500 coins. Again, like, that, that's just a pittance. It's, like, nothing. 82 defence, 80, 80 physical, and 69 pace. Very, very similar centre-backs there, and they work very, very well. Now, on the right, we don't have a league of one. I'm going to have to put any league. Because I didn't do this before, and I'm an idiot. Anyway, we've got Pereira, uh, the one that plays for Porto. Again, very, very cheap, 800 coins. Nothing special, but a fairly solid uh, right-back option there for your team. Uh, on the left, we have, if I can find him, there we go. We've got Bernat for Bayern Munich. Last year, he was red. This year, he isn't, so I believe he's like 400 coins or something. He's really, really cheap. Um, uh, well, it might, might be like 700, but still, this entire defense will probably cost you about 3k, if that. You can probably get it for even cheaper. It's crazy, crazy cheap. And now we move on to the most expensive player on the team, I believe, and that is Xabi Alonso. CDM, very, very good, and he, he's great in this team because he's a great passer, and that's a key attribute on this FIFA. As you can see, you can probably pick him up for about 3 to 4k if you like, if you wait a couple of minutes while sniping, etc. I'm sure you'll be able to get a decent deal for him. Then, the first centre mid, I believe, is Enzonzi, if I've done that right. I think it is. Uh, I'm just going to double check to make sure that I haven't screwed this up. I don't think I have. But yeah, I, wait, the next one, is it Mbulu? I do apologise, I do do a lot of squad builders, and I should have had this registered before, but I think it is. I think it's Enzonzi and Mbulu, my bad. 950 coins for Enzonzi, 6 foot 3, again, a giant in the middle, which is great for heading down the balls when the goalkeeper's kicked it to you. Mbulu, 6 foot 1, very, very solid as well. So, we move on to the cam here, and the first cam we've got is Hananes, an extremely good cam. Honestly, I've liked him all the way through FIFA's five-star week for four-star skill moves. Exceptional player, and uh, yeah, he's just an all-around beast, essentially. And then the two strikers, first one we've got is Morata, and the second one to finish this off is Menes, who is a centre-forward. You can just get a centre-forward card and uh, minus the one or two chemistry points, but I uh, moved him to a striker. Now, Morata's about 6k, but I think he'll be about 4 to 5 now. Oh, Jesus Christ, he's even less now. He's like 3k, so that really, really is a lot cheaper. So this team probably doesn't even hit 20k. Uh, Menes, again, to get striker one, 2k, 2k, it's like nothing, and Hernanes, I think he's really, really cheap as well, um, yeah, he's like literally 2k, so I don't even think this team actually hits 20k, it's under that budget, but there you go, I think that's a 4 league, is it? Yes, it is, we've got Liga Portuguesa, La Liga, Bayern Munich, well, Bundesliga, and Serie A, so yeah, uh, as always, let me know any suggestions in the comments and I'll go through the highlights now. What I love about cheap teams is essentially, as long as they're half decent, you can't really complain too much. And that's exactly what this team is. I mean, it's not amazing, but it does the job. And I would say it can get you through the divisions, especially if you're, you know, a try-hard FIFA player. Then I'm pretty sure you'll be able to make it pretty far through divisions. Uh, All Black actually scored me a couple of goals. That's because he was the corner taker and I managed to dribble through a couple of times. But yeah, uh, he's a great goalkeeper, to be honest. The defence, 
for like 3k it really really is solid like it, it is very very solid especially for the coins you're paying the midfield is a similar kind of thing i mean you've got two people who over six foot which is really really useful they're very strong in in zonzi and in bulu and then you've got xabi alonso who's a little bit more defensive than both of those they, they all are quite defensive which is probably why i could easily you know convert attack into defense because they were always available right next to the defense and they've all got decent passing particularly Xabi Alonso and yeah it was brilliant the forward three as well I've got to say Hernanes or Pereira you could use if you want uh, since they're both cams for Juventus both of them are absolutely exceptional cams uh, Hernanes he's got a lethal long shot and he's got a great pass and then the two forwards do combine pretty well Menes bit more pace bit more dribbling uh, Morata he's just got a lethal shot he's literally got a power shot if you can get him in any sort of space near the box just take a shot and most of the time it'll rifle in I mean a lot of the time I did hit the post of the ball which seemed to be a little bit irritating he did that four times in one match but aside from that he's very very good and he's a great great finisher so overall for 20k I mean, I recommend you try this team out at least. I mean, you can sell it instantly if you want to. But uh, yeah, it, it is well worth a go, especially for that kind of money. I mean, there's virtually like no loss involved, uh, essentially. So I would definitely recommend trying it out. Leave a comment below if you want me to build a squad. And yeah, cheers to Dylan again and peace.